At 42 years old and still playing professional football, former Celtic hero Shunsuke Nakamura, hopes Angie Postacogla, will continue to raid the J-League market in future transfer windows, after insisting the club's new Japanese signings gives him great pleasure. The Celtic boss brought striker Kyogo Furuhashi to Parkhead in the summer, before returning to Japan's top tier to Lord Trio Daisen Maeda, Ryo Hattate and Yosuke Idaguchi to Glasgow in January. It has been a successful avenue for Postacogla, with all four players proving an instant hit with supporters, and Nakamura, has backed more Japanese players to make the cross-continent switch to his former club. The 43-year-old, who joined Celtic in 2005 under Gordon Strachan from Italian outfit Regina, made over 100 appearances for the Hoops and is renowned as one of the club's greatest set-piece specialists of all time. Nakamura became the first Japanese player to score in the Champions League and was nominated for the Ballon d'Or in 2007. He is eager to see further Japanese stars make history in the Scottish Premiership, and in Europe. Speaking to the Celtic View, he said, Their success is a genuine pleasure for me, and I'm very glad to see Angie Postacogla take charge and take four Japanese players over who are all playing well. I think Celtic have four really good players. Yosuke has more than 10 caps for Japan and is a great talent. Ryo is only getting better by the day and won two league titles in Japan. Daizen is very quick and has all the ability required for modern football and matches the style of the manager. I hope more Japanese players will join Celtic in the future and help the club, but I also have my former teammate Stephen McManus who is now a coach there, and I wish him good luck. Nakamura, who currently plays for J2 League side Yokohama FC, revealed he still keeps an eye out for Celtic's results from across the globe. You heard that correct he's still playing. He added, I am one of the Celtic supporters in the Far East now and I hope they will all carve their name in the history of the club and I wish them all the best. Meanwhile, Rio Hattate will have to wait a bit longer to make his senior international debut after the midfielder was left out of Japan's starting lineup for their World Cup qualifier against Australia. The 24 year old utility man, who can operate at left wing back or as a midfielder, has generally featured in an energetic number eight role, by Angie Postacogla. National team boss Hajime Moriyaju had previously spoken about how Hattate's versatility could prove beneficial in their upcoming games and offered an insight into how his role might differ from that at the club level. He said, Hey Tate's adjusted to playing in the Premiership, and living in Scotland, and looking at his performances, I decided to call him up. I think he'll be able to play the inside half role he's been in for Celtic, but I also think, he can play at other positions. The former Kawasaki frontale man, played a starring role in the prestigious Toulon tournament in 2019 and was selected as part of Japan's 2020 Olympics squad in Tokyo, alongside Hoops teammate Daisen Maeda. Hattate is the only Celtic player in the current squad, with Kyogo Furuhashi ruled out with a hamstring injury, Maeda withdrawing due to fitness concerns, and Yosuke Idaguchi struggling for game time. Is it just me or is it mad to think that Naka is still playing at 42 years old? Hold my pint, give the ball says Naka. And on that note have a great day Celtic fans all around the world. Let roll up to the party, roll up, roll up to the party, roll up to the party, roll up, roll up to the party.